School districts across the nation, frankly, preparing for the fall school season. That's expected to look a lot different. North Shore is among them, and it was the first in the nation to cancel school back in March because of COVID. Now the superintendent is attempting to blaze a new trail yet again. It's a new school year, whether we're physical or virtual. Dr. Michelle Reed, North Shore's superintendent, knows it will be a school year like no other, calling the latest edition North Shore Learns 3.0. We want to take the best of North Shore Learns 1.0 and 2.0 and keep those while we build a more robust, we think, and more engaging community building type program. For North Shore, that means giving students more time for independent learning this fall and more one-on-one -on -one time with the teacher. For parents, a more clear one-stop shop learning management system is coming to better help them navigate through life as an at-home teacher. This time around, a lot of students will have never even met their teacher before. So what we've done is we've actually captured our student parent conference days that were later in November, and we've moved those conference days to the beginning of school. There's also this community dial with built-in benchmarks so families can see how close school is to returning to the classroom. For many parents, they want that to be sooner than later. Full-time remote learning is a tough pill for many to swallow. Our students are looking at us and they're taking their cues from us about how excited they are for the year. Now, but the union president who represents the district's teachers and staff members say dozens of teachers and staff are quitting because they can't go through remote learning again. We'll have more on that at the bottom of the hour.